Yo, what's going on YouTube? How you guys doing today, baby? Let's go. I'm hyped. Look at this view. It's a nice day out too, baby. So I'm just happy to be riding for real. Um, but today's topic is gonna be uh, how to buy a used motorcycle. So. You know, let's just hop right into the video, right? Um, so, like, first, obviously, you're gonna want to find the bike, right? I'll check like Facebook Marketplace or some shit, something like that. And you know, you want to make sure, like, when you look at it, you need to make sure there's good pictures, quality pictures, because you don't want to go there and, and it's just like a total like pile of shit, you know? Kind of like, kind of like being catfished, you know? But yeah, you know, make sure there's good pictures. Um, and make sure, make sure it has a decent description. Uh, like, what's the price at? Is it like, is it, is it too high, too low? Um, maybe deal them down a little bit. Um, and take your time researching for a bike that you like or that you want that you think suitable for you. You know, like I took my time looking for the, this this 400. God, I went back and forth from the 400 and the R3. And you know, came out with the 400, baby. Um, but yeah, so that's first. Like, find the bike. Make sure make sure it's a bike you like. Yeah, so coming in second, you know, you wanna, you're gonna want to communicate with the dude, obviously. Um, like you know, make sure it's an actual. He's an actual jit, you know. Ask him questions too. Like, ask him a lot of questions. You know, try to dig deep. See, like, because you know, you know, some people try and cover shit up. Um, you you don't want that. That shit sucks. I think that's never happened to me. Um, but yeah, so communicate with the dude. Make sure you know. Make sure there's a title. So yeah, I know, and like tell them like before before you go there, um, like make sure to leave the bike cold, um, because then like you know you start it up, it's a true cold start. And, you know, make sure everything really works, turns on, because like you know sometimes they can leave it they can leave it running warm. Try to try and cover something up, so you don't want that. Make sure to leave that shit cold. Oh, but yeah, go back to the first one. You want to inspect, like, inspect, inspect the bike. How does it look in those pictures? Like, does it look like a piece of shit or what? Like shit's like shit's rusted, the paint and all that. You know. But just for that second, uh, third, third is probably gonna be. You know, make sure he has the title. Make sure, make sure everything matches up, like the VIN number. Uh, to make sure he's just not like trying to trying to lie or be be weird about any of that shit. And yeah, you know, cause you, you obviously you don't want a bike. You want a bike that's freaking stolen, or you know that, that's just all bad news. So the fourth thing you want kind of want to do is uh, assess the bike. Obviously, like when you get there, you know, like check all the fluids, check the oil, um, check the brakes if you can check the brake fluid. Uh, you know, just check and make sure all the fluids are up, and, and, and make sure the dude actually took care of his bike. Um, also, when you want to assess it, you want to check the paint, like how's the how's the gas tank, just like the fairings, all that. You don't want to scratch it up or. God damn, fuck this road, dude. Fuck Ohio. This shit sucks. You know, you don't want scratches. You don't want the paint really like fading or anything. Ow, oh, damn. Something bug just hit me in the hand. Um, yeah, you know, uh, I would check the brakes, clutch, and everything. Make sure all that shit works. Um, another big one's gonna be the chain. You're gonna want to check the chain. Make sure it's in between like an inch. Make sure it's, you know, how's it look? Does it look old? Um, you know, 
I was like, did, did, basically we're looking for, did the dude take care of his bike or not? Um, but yeah, you, you want to make sure you look for all that. And another, another one after chain is going to be tires. I, is there still tread? Because obviously you're not going to want to buy a bike with shit tires ready because that's going to be another like 300 whatever 400 bucks that you're going to have to spend for tires hell no we don't want that so yeah make sure you get a good inspection and if you, you don't know too much about like inspecting it or anything you bring a buddy with you bring your parent um if they know anything about bikes just bring someone you know help you look at the bike and like I said, ask him questions, you know? To make sure he actually took care of his shit. Number five, uh, ask him if you can test ride it. Try test riding it. Cause they get, that's gonna de uh, depend like whether you like the bike or not you know or that'll be one of the factors um, so yeah ask him to test ride to have the money ready because he's probably gonna ask for the money if you crash it you're gonna have to pay for it no matter what probably and then yeah after after you freaking you, you test ride the bike you know if you've assessed it it looks good and the price is, isn't bad you know maybe you try dealing them down a little bit if it's too high um, you know, all that good stuff. Then, you know, buy the bike. And yeah, those are pretty much like, those are pretty much the tips that I would give on, on getting a new motorcycle. Um, so yeah, like, you, you know, I think that's pretty much it. Um, you know, once you have your bike, you know, have fun with it. And if you're new, take your time, learn. There's no, no need to rush into anything. Um, I feel like I'm missing something, I don't know why. <laughs> That's why you give him the thumbs up, baby. That's why you gotta give him the thumbs up, baby. <laughs> He'll give you a little bit of action. So yeah, you know, that'll be it uh, for today's video on uh, getting a new bike. If you are getting a new bike, Congratulations, baby. Have fun out there. If you like the video, like always, make sure to leave a thumbs up. Drop a comment down below. And subscribe always, baby. Love all you guys. Thanks for the support. And ride safe. Over and out.